when you get in a position where you might be voluntold or you feel obligated to volunteer because someone has a need, just remember like this David thing. Did to me. Yeah, right, mm -hmm. exactly. Yeah. Um, no one will ever ask you to accomplish your priorities. They will only ask you to accomplish theirs. That's so good, say, say it again. It, I'm gonna say it again. No one will ever ask you to accomplish your priorities. They will only ask you to accomplish theirs. And that is a quote from Carrie Newhoff. And when I heard that, I just, I, I hit pause. I'm like, I gotta write this down mm -hmm. because wow. And, and this is what I was talking about at the beginning of the podcast. It's like such a simple truths that you don't think about, but when you hear it in words like that, you're like, yeah, that's exactly it. That is exactly the position we put ourselves in. Yes, because what leader does not walk into their office and before you've even sat your bag down, someone's coming at you with their problems that need resolution and they have priorities that they have to check off their list for the day because you gave them that you know job and said these are my expectations and they're coming to you now for feedback insight whatever and it's you know it's instantaneous so let's talk about you know the how to manage your energy zones which this is what we were talking about with the red yellow and green which was something i had not heard until just the other day when i was listening to uh, Carrie on the Craig Rochelle podcast and I said to David oh there's this guy Carrie Newhoff on Craig Rochelle he goes yeah he's on Andy Stanley and it's like you know when you're just circled by great leaders and it's tying together in a time where you're not even seeking it out but it just hits you of mm -hmm. like oh this was really meant for us and that's why we want to share it because it was just so relevant right now.